Greetings and salutations. Alrighty. Just give it a minute it's here. Alright. Thank you for joining us with Let's Play with Zori. Today we're continuing on with uh, the Living World Season 3, Tiny's Game. Use the gate in Radanovus to travel to... Uh, eh. Use the gate in Radasum to travel to Novus. Alright. We're going to continue on. Continue on. Okay. <sighs> Should be up in a at a mini second now. Yeah, we destroyed his golem in the other one. We to the dragon research lab. Timey, please tell me there was some sort of calculations error. Primordis is really active. An error? You think I made it? Hey, good to see you too. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't think we'd be dealing with another dragon so soon. About that, I have some good news and bad news. What's the bad news? Great idea. Good news first. Huh. Feast your eyes and blindfolds on this. Different tile on the ground. Impressive. Yeah. <laughs> no. This is another one of Rada Novus's secrets I discovered. Stand there and you'll be ported to this crazy simulation room the Novans developed but never finished. And you finished it? Well, n no, I couldn't, you know, figure it out. What's that? <laughs> I couldn't figure it out, okay? Just so happens to fall outside my giant, incredibly deep pool of knowledge. Whatever, it works now. I called in Moto, an Asura with some experience in that realm. Huh. He got it up and running for me. What's it do? It can process numerous experimental theories, but the Rada Novans developed it to test themselves against various Primordus minions. Want to check it out? Sure. Yes. It'll be yes. helpful to find yes. out what we're about to go up against. Perfect. It'll also help me run some numbers and see what the room's capable of. Another loading screen. Yay! Three loading screens in a minute. That's fabulous. Speeding up, Speeding up, up please. please. Okay, wave one incoming, folks. Ready, Ridlock? It's fake fighting. How hard can it be? I'll note any patterns or specific attacks I see while you're taking care of business. These little bubbles put out fire. So, let's keep that in mind. Yeah! Thus they die, you can see that they use these little portal things. burn out normally. Touch. Poof. It all goes bye bye. And they do respawn, so don't worry. When do you ever sleep? No time for that, Commander. It was one thing going against Mordermoth, 
Of course, you want to save the planet, but being a Sura and facing Primordis... Well, I hope you know we're all behind you. I thought we had our hands full with Karakas and Lazarus, but I think we can squeeze in a quick trip to the Shiver Peaks to take down a dragon. Well, there's a little more I haven't told you yet. According to what I documented, Primordis is awake. You know this. But here's the more part. It's moved, tunneled its way down to the Fire Islands, south of Maguma. If we know where it is now, let's just go knock at its door and give it a welcome basket. Why did it move? I posit Mordermoth's death and the subsequent magic release must have jump-started Primordis. And then, with a lot of energy pooling in the south, what better place to be? So it relocated to get more powerful. Great. That exploded into another mother crap. Most epic game out there, but it was first that they allowed consoles to have an online RPG. I love the little kids. He likes to go Tough though, so... 
another Asura in here? I thought you were keeping all this secret. Had a cameo on it. A, he's cool, don't worry. And B, someone had to watch Max while Moto and I got this thing up and running. You already have people in the Fire Island? I have some more, let's say, trusted associates there setting up a gate and scouting. But Flood really organized the whole operation. Primordis's movement was something I purposely let slip. It's good. Him out of my ears for a little while, and that also makes him feel like a fish. Only 16 years old, and your puppet master and one of your superiors. Admirable, and a little unsettling, Tiger. <laughs> I'll soon rule you up! <laughs> oh, sorry, was he calling me that? Big Dad coming? Krakatora can ditto for uh, what's his name? Brain malfunction starts with an S. Sea Dragon. All this machinery has to be good for something. Why don't you channel some patience from the mists there, Bune? A whole civilization of brilliant Asura couldn't find it. But yeah, I got this in five minutes. Maybe if you were as open with your research as you were with your mouth, you'd have cracked it by now. Whoa. You're going to lecture me on openness? Remind me again what happened to you in the mists. Oh, that's right, zipper lips. Hey. Okay, okay. We're all on the same team here. But have you made any progress? Only a few huge leaps. First, remember my chalk organ? The horribly disgusting body part of an even more horribly disgusting giant bug that you keep in the despicable blighting pod fluid? <laughs> Yes, I remember, despite desperately trying to forget. I named it Spencer. Great. And it's somehow more disturbing. Don't listen to him. Anyway, I discovered why lay energy is different when you run through him, and it's paradigm shifting. Chalk feed off lay energy, right? And we know that Deep Dragon has a domain when it comes to their magic. Zaitan's was death, obviously. Well, you know what's guaranteed? Spencer filtered death out of lay energy. So magic is almost like light, broken up into 
a spectrum. That's a perfect way to think about it. Magic as we know it is like white light, composed of all the different types of dragon magic. I'm gonna go down in a certain history oh, logs for this discovery. As much as I love discussing minutia, how does this help us? I don't know yet, but I will. I'll never sleep again. Now, I'm sure you're anxious to try out your moves against the real thing in the Fire Islands, so let's head back to the main lab. Thus, you've been stripped of your rank and are hereby charged with dereliction of duty. You're to come with us, Ricklock. Sir. Sir. And if I don't? We've been authorized to use force. But we'd hate to cause a scene. I'm sure you would, pup. <sighs> Getting this assignment, you two must either be the best warriors in the Iron Legion, or the ones with the worst luck. <laughs> so... Top of my class. But it's starting to feel like both. Ridlock? It's okay, Commander. I'll straighten it out. It appears I underestimated the Citadel's response. Hope you enjoy the metal I'm earning you today, soldier. You get to return with Ridlock Brimstone. Without a fight, depends on my travel accommodations. <laughs> but you can have my seat. Come on, Vicon. You didn't groom him too? <laughs> to work on Scrubby 2.0. Plus, I need to start experimenting on the thing I told you about and the thing about the new thing, findings. I understand. understand? <laughs> help! Someone help! Wendell, what happened? In the Fire Islands, our party lost. We shouldn't have strayed from the main outposts. Cammy held them off as long as she could, but no! Did she make it? No. She... They changed, Timey. The destroyer's there. Oh. Changed? How? Like a Mordrum. Unstoppable. Risen and Mordrum? What do you mean? They're not like they were. Different attacks. A different feel. Hey, it's okay. Take him away and give him some care. What do you think that all meant? Not sure. dramatic in a way like it wasn't really supposed to be there like it was forced
Commander, welcome to the Fire Islands. Apt name for this rock. I'm surprised anything can survive here. Can you give me a status report? We're still assessing, but our preliminary findings are troubling. Primordius' arrival is having a profound impact on the island. The destroyers are surging in record numbers, and there's been a marked increase in the local seismic and volcanic activity. I've been trying to get word to Tiny. The atmospheric interference is wreaking havoc on our long-range comms. I doubt you'll get much use out of that communicator she gave you while you're here. About the destroyers, we received word that they've been exhibiting new abilities, changed somehow. I'm here to gather samples to confirm the report. Where should I begin my search? Hmm. Not long ago, we sent a scout east to locate a nest. I begin your search there. Okay, and depending on your perks, you can choose which way you want to go. You can use either the updrafts, the lay energy, or if you get the new perk, the thermal tube, you can get sent right there. I think I'm just gonna take the ley energy. Not a direct route, but it'll take us where we need to go. We sit here and collect all this energy. watching my work get repeatedly dismantled by monsters, so if you don't mind... Easy there. I'm easy. I'm here to help you retrieve those destroyer samples. At last, support! I located a sizable destroyer nest, but the beasts ambushed me. Made a mess of my comms equipment. Help me deal with the destroyers and fix the equipment, and I'll get any samples you retrieve back to Tiny. Consider it done. Let's move quickly. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can all retreat to a less life-threatening environment. Now this is more kind of RNG-based. Like, these two down, this one down here, we'll start the recording device. That's scripted. But getting the core could take minutes, could take hours, depending on your luck. those samples now. Rest assured, I'll get them to tiny at once. Finished with that. Oh my, that's not normal. Not normal? How not normal? 
Ember Bay's always presented powerful volcanic and seismic activity, but the intensity of these events is unprecedented. Thanks to Black Mortis, I guess. The ground felt like it was about to come apart right under us. Are the islands in danger? Given the dragon's presence, it's certainly a possibility. Unfortunately, I lack the proper equipment to know for sure. One of my colleagues was tasked with monitoring the seismic activity just east of here. He may know more. I'll check it out. And just for irony's sake. <laughs> Another kitty. If I... No. What if, uh... Oh, this miserable device! Please tell me how to activate it! <laughs> Smelly Asura will ruin everything! Leave it to Script! Champions of Rockface! <laughs> What's going on here? According to the Script, this device has something to do with the building seismic pressure beneath the island. If we can't figure out how to activate it, the pressure builds and builds until... Well... As the scrits say, pop, 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 wee. <laughs> or it may all be nonsense. I can't tell what these creatures are blabbering about half the time anyway. This rock face they speak of knows more, but they won't let me get close enough to ask how to work this blasted machine. Let me talk to them. I'll get to the bottom of this. I hope you do, Commander. We're running perilously short on time. Call it here. I do appreciate you joining us to play with Dory. And I think I'll see you guys next week.